Hello everybody, I'm Enchanted Moon and welcome to my channel. I have another unboxing for you today. It's from the Luna, it's from Wolf and Time, I'm sorry, but it's the Luna Lux box. So, this is the highest tier they have. And this is for September. Couple more for September and I can't believe it's gonna be October. My gosh, this year is just going by way too fast. Ooh, we got a pretty burgundy, I guess you would say, or cranberry with a nice little leaf sticker. Very nice. Oops, that sounds like coming out. So let's see what this is about. Okay. I'm not gonna do it over. Okay. Alright, so the first thing we have are two intent sticks. And I'm gonna light one now. Move my lab. So we can cleanse our space and make it nice and cozy. And magical. Then I can get a preview of the scent. So there's two sticks. All right. Then we have our paperwork on aged paper. I'm just gonna peek for the theme. Deep in the woods, the spirits there start to release their summer leaves, their dried blooms and hardened seeds. Fall has arrived and the theme this month is autumn abundance. We now get to celebrate with the harvest feast on the goodness of that nature has brought us. Watch the trees transform into golden colors and create rituals of release, gratitude, and balance in our self-care magic. So, that is what the theme is. Right on top, we have this beautiful card. It says, a Autumn Abundant Ritual. Look how pretty that is. That is just very, very beautiful. I like that a lot. Cool, so that is our first item. Our second item is we have a, looks like an oracle card. Very interesting. And mine says, I have no idea. <laughs> and that's what, I'm not butchering that at all. So I'm not even gonna try. Chathutha da Danane? I don't know. Anyway, very pretty. Oh, goodness. Sounds like a fire. Our art is... Oh, it's so pretty. Look at this. The deer's antlers are just like a bunch of trees. Look at that. That's so nice with branches. Very beautiful. Very, very gorgeous. I love all her art. It's just simply stunning. Okay. Then we have a couple items in the box, so I'm, I don't know what to grab first. But I'm going to grab this guy first. We have a sachet. Cotton. And it says right here, Autumn Abundance Tea. It's a pretty decent size. Um, I don't know. Let me see if I can give you guys a peek at it. But that's really tied in a big knot here. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to open it. Anyway, I'm sure you can make a couple pots of tea. Mmm, smells good. And it's got to have the, in, in, the ingredients in the paperwork. So, we'll get to that. All right. Then we have this pretty sachet. And it has the triquatra in there. Altar tile. In silver. 
And just to get you a closer looky. Very nice. And this says, bonus item. Ooh, Trichopatra Silver Tile. For you to continue, for your continued patient understanding for late. Oh, that was nice. They, they gave that to us just because the box was late. I didn't even notice, honestly. I figured if I don't get it by the, the month, then I message. But that was very sweet to throw in an extra item. Okay, then we have another one of those cotton sachets. And this one has, let's see, a tea light. And this has a few bay leaves in it. There's a couple of these in there. So that must be for the ritual, maybe. Let me see. Mm, I don't see it. Oh, yeah, it does say bay leaves, tea light. Yeah, so this is part of the abundance ritual. And these are probably the other items for the abundance ritual. Yeah, we have a little bag of rose hips. That goes for this ritual as well. So you got a little bag of rose hips. Oh, let me see. I can't open these. They're really tight. And then we have the other one is elderflower. So we have all the ingredients. Rose hips, elderflower, bay leaves, tea light, abundance tea, which is here. I'm not going to read everything else. It's going to give it away. All right. I think that's it on this side. Then we have this box. And in here, we have this. They have some nice quality. This is a heavy duty, heavy duty stainless triquatra. Looks like it's in a three leaf clover, too. That is very nice. And I mean, this is thick, heavy stainless so this could be male or female very long chain very nice very nice okay then we have on this side this must be the salts that go with the ritual We have this jar here. Mmm, that smells so yummy. With the abundant salts. We have this big velvet bag. Okay, let's see what this is. Wow. Big garnet spear. Big. Let me get this light down so it doesn't. Uh. Here we go. Oh, that's even worse. Maybe that's better. There we go. Look at that. That's huge. Garnet Spear. I think that goes with the Rose Hips, Elderflower, Bay Leaves, Tea Light, Abundant Salts, Abundant Tea, Garnet Spear, Pot, A Cauldron, or Plate, Pen and Matches. So, this all goes for this uh, ritual here. Abundance Ritual. And then we have one more item, and that's in here. And I believe that's it that's in here. Okay. The last item is this. I'm not sure what this is. It looks like a chalice box, but I'm not sure. What is this? Oh, I, I don't know. Oh, wow. It's gorge. It's a beautiful goddess. Mm. 
Look at that. Very cool. Well, very nice box as always. Let me go through the paperwork on the theme. Oh my God, the wind is just picked up very bad. And those noises you're gonna hear are acorns. Anybody needs any acorns, let me know. I got plenty. All right, goddess of the woods statue. As she reaches her arms up above to touch the light of the sun, your petite statue of the goddess of the wood shares nature's beauty in her spirit form. Part of earth reaching from her roots down and part of the sky reaching her branches up from her crown. She represents autumn days of warm golden energy, fallen leaves creating bare branches and the feeling of letting go. She can be one of your deities, the soul of Maban, the essence of nature, or she can even represent you. Very cool. Love this. It's like a, maybe a wood or like a light resin. Very cool. I don't want to break it. Next ice, uh, item is the Trike Watcher Medallion Necklace. Two-sided medallion is made from solid stainless steel and is held by a sturdy king's chain. The symbol of the Trike Watcher, or the Latin, means three-cornered. The line is unbroken and never ending, representing the multitude of symbolization of many paths. It brings the trick brings unity, protection, everlasting life, strength in the triple moon, the triple goddess, and the three phases. It dates far back as the 4th century BC and has been found on items such as coins, pottery, stones, walls, runestones, heritage sites. Its Celtic pagan culture is also the meaning of body, mind, and soul, past, present, future, life, death, and rebirth, land, sea, and sky. Your medallion also has a center circle that Three additional circles are interlocked together. So as we are all connected to the circle of life, the wheel of the year, and the four seasons. Very cool. And again, this is, like I said, a very absolutely sturdy piece of jewelry. That I would sell in my store for $25 to $30. This is probably another $25 to $30. Autumn Abundance Ritual Page Bay Leaf Tea Light Pouch. The ritual page has been created for your journal, Book of Shadows, or Grimoire, and invites you to manifest an abundance of gr and great gratitude. All the items you need are in the box, except for common things that are best done on the waxing or full moon. In addition, you will find a small cotton bag with your bay leaves and tea light included to complete your ritual kit. This... Wow, those acorns are really hammering. Oh, and then I had the little pouch right here with the tea light in the bay leaves. Then it has the elder, it says the elder flowers, the rose hips. Rose hips or the fruit of the wild roses has many different properties, both metaphysical and medicinal. It's used in your included ritual and can also be used for recharging your root chakras, heart chakras, and holds the vibrations of death of things that no longer serve and the rebirth of new beginnings. It is the element of water corresponds with Venus and the moon and connects mostly with Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, birth signs. Commonly, it is included in magic for love, psychic powers, luck, healing, peace, protection, mystery, friendship, knowledge, and abundance. That was the rose. And then the elder flowers, again, were for the ritual, and it's also an offering gateway in connection to nature's other realm. Dry blooms are also represent death and rebirth, helping you open your third eye to spirits, heal emotional issues, calm and ground the soul, opens the heart chakra, guides you through stressful times, and amplifies rituals, meditation, and protection. And again, it can be used in the ritual as well. Mystic Sisters Oracle Card by Emily 
Belevet, B-E-L-I-V-E-T, Mystic Sisters Oracle Deck. Of course, the beautiful artwork, which is the 8x10 called Autumn Light, original painting made by for just this box, using the Shawin, Sam, Sawin, I'm sorry, Shaman, goodness, ritual. I created this with the intention of feeling the glow of the autumn sun, the energy of great abundance and inner wisdom. I use blessed salts and essential oils, harvest spice, polysanto smoke, forest incense, and watercolor ink and gel pen. If you have an 8x10 print version with the mystical buck and its falling tree leaves, creating nature's abundance, the buck brings you the insight to appreciate the beauty all around you with the energy center of the heart chakra and the element of air. It symbolizes the gods of the forest, the spirits within the crescent moon, and the companion of the goddess. Absolutely beautiful. Then, and then of course this is the baths, the abundant salts that go with the ritual as well. that over there. I don't want to break my stuff. Then it goes into the, the autumn tea we had. For, that's for the ritual too. And then the premium. Oh, this is garnet and astrophyllite. That explains the discoloring in it over here. Astrophyllite. This can go for 50 or $55 or more. So this box and then of course you're free. This is another 12th 15 bucks because it's silver or it's tired. It has a nice weight to it. This box is just blown me away in value for sure, always. Um, find a new trial to adventure, create a fall memory, stay in your joy, manifest abundance. Next month's theme is Whispering Shadows, Heritage, Familiars, and Spirit Rituals. And then, of course, your incense, which is burning so nice. I can't express, explain the smell, but it smells so yummy. Um, so yeah, that is September's box. I absolutely love it. I love the colors. I love that we have a nice spell. Everything was included, except of course for uh, a powder cauldron or a burn plate. You guys, um, most people have that. If not, you can run and get one. Thank you guys for watching. I will leave the information about this box in the description below. Be well. Thanks for watching. I already said that. Doi. Uh, be well. And look for my next crystal show. I have so many crystals I bought for the store that it's awesome and I can't wait to share them with you. But we'll also have a live crystal show on our Instagram page, Tina's This and That, this Thursday, which I believe is the last Thursday of September. I believe it's September 30th, if I am to be correct. Yes. Thursday, September 30th. It will be between 6 and 7 starting. I believe it's probably going to be 6. Maybe 7. But if you want to check it out, check us out on Tina's This and That Instagram page. It'll be live this Thursday. Awesome crystals. Be safe, guys. Bye now.